to Mike. Got it? Okay, that's okay, let me know. I turn it on, but I'll, I'll, let me know. Yeah, nice. I like this neck and the, the pull a little bit down like this. Good. I'm sorry? You got it or no? Okay, good. Super. All right, see if he wants to drop a little bit more, little down. The, the, the softness and the trueness is good. There you go, super nice, very good. Yeah, and it's good to do some smaller circles and then leg yield them out. So you use the leg yields pretty much all over your riding, in the circles and really from a, like a center line and a, like a leg yield out, super nice. Yeah, he's super light, huh? Very good, see if he wants to drop just a little more, nice. Awesome. And let kill them out again. Super. Boy. Cool. Yeah, I like it. I still think I like this arena for him. <laughs> cool. Yeah, super. So when you push your hands forward, the goal is that he drops a little bit into that contact. Nice. Awesome. Very. I would definitely do some smaller circles and then leg yield it out. And drop him a little bit again in the neck. You got it. Super. Very good. Nice. Boy. It's still humid today, but it's a little break, so that's nice. Good. And this size of 40. <laughs> And just let you over. Good. Super. Oh, good. And lower a little. Flex a little in and flex a little out and then see where you go from there. When it, Sometimes he gets so light that nothing happens. Then it just stays there. Then it's up to you to find the contact. His mouth and then super nice, really nice. Go a little bit back to the right, we'll do some leg yields and then some canter the part. Good, oh, good with the whip. You're better with the whip, <laughs> good. yeah. It'll save you from young horses, too. Sometimes, <laughs> oh, nice, very good, and just pick a line. Molecules. And if you want, you can keep posting it and then uh, just very beautiful. You can exaggerate the bend a little bit if you want to. The inside leg stays at the girt. So this side is really to get the shoulder over, to drop the shoulder, keep him down and a little more. If you need a circle, do it. Just make a 10 meter circle or a 12 meter. So the goal, that's what we need. And push another few steps of leg heels. That's the good news with this big arena. And you can keep the hands definitely lower if you need to. And come again, center line and leg. Just pick a center line and leg heel. And the goal is that he stays lower and relaxed and nice and through. And yeah, and push over. Good. Keep your weight over a little bit over to your left knee. Got it. So your left shoulder over your net, left knee. Supplement. That's better. Good boy, better, 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 nice. All right, super. Come again, and then go a little bit steeper this time, so you really make him go sideways. Let the shoulder go. More shoulder thinking and haunches, and over and over, and make another 10 meter circle again. Get him through and down, good. Oh, super, and flex him on the inside. Get him exaggerate, right hand down and in. Good, super. All right, a minute. Let's start preparing for a canter the part whenever you're ready. But take your time to prepare and ride the tempo back a little bit. And the goal is that he stays down. When he comes up already, take your time first to get him lower again. 
because there, there's no need for him to come up and make himself hollow and then jump into it. So the goal is that he stays low in the neck and gets into it in a real nice round frame. So your hands can be a little bit lower and wider apart. Exactly, it's okay. Super. Ah, nice. And half hold enough. So when he's a little bit too forward, then you feel he just drops faster. It's a very fine line between keeping him under you and with you and then ask for the canter. Exactly, slow him down a little bit. Exactly. And push through. All right, so he got a little higher, a little hollow back. We keep, then at that moment you gotta push through. Once you're in it already, you cannot say, okay, we'll trot again and do it again. Then you keep going and lower him. And this side, yeah, and down, in the downward the same. Huh? So use your hands to keep him down in the downward, not to bring him back. And even a little bit lower if you can. See if you can get him even a little bit down in the, more down in the pole. Good. Ride him under you and collect it. That's right, hands low and down. Just think a little side range. So you really tell him it's okay to stay right there. Well done. Better, better, better. Well done. All right. And now a little bit into that contact again. Inside rein and the inside leg stays at the girth. And almost think a little bit um, time. So you have the outside leg back and you let the left shoulder drop to the left. Yeah, good. And you think like leg heeled out and riding the butt in. <laughs> Good, and with the left hand, see if you push it forward, see if he drops a little bit into that contact. Yeah, nice. Very good. Super. Do not trust him, huh? <laughs> good, and keep suppling on the right rein. Yes, yes, it's a constant suppling. It's not a holding rein. It's a suppling rein. And inside spur, good. And, and literally, you can do leg yield out, huh? Like anywhere you want to do, you got plenty of room. Push him out for the inside leg, good. And you give on the left. Good, super, super, got to drop into that field, drop into that contact. Think leg yield out again, push him out, don't trust him. And when you think leg yield out on him, especially going to the right, the leg stays more closer to the girth than a little back, because we do not want his haunches out, we want his shoulder out, yeah. And see if he wants to come even a little bit lower and a little bit longer in the frame. Yeah, nice. I love this rhythm, but don't trust him. <laughs> Especially when he starts to relax. And then it's very easy for him to fall into a T-R-O-T. All right, super. And ride a little shoulder in again. And then just flex him more to the right. See if you can keep him lower. And then prepare to go to your T-R-O-T. Take your time and try to keep him down. No hands. Your hands are just for suppling. You're riding him back from your seat. Hands are for suppling. Awesome, beautiful, very smooth. That's what we're after. I think he needs a little walk break and we'll do the, the left lead. Hands forward now too. Okay, trot again and literally push him forward. I literally push your hands forward. You can keep your fingers to say, yeah, just do it on a circle. Go walk forward, forward, forward. Well done, <laughs> good job. All right, awesome, good. Good oh boy, well, it's good you rode him yesterday so well, for sure, yeah. Good job, he's sweating or not, or was he wet? No, he's oh, awesome. Good boy, smart. <laughs> oh, yeah. So it's perfect arena, huh? Yeah. I'm glad we did it. It's good after a lot of rain. Nice. So tomorrow at one, Kathleen? Good. I think I told you to tomorrow, huh? 
as one, yeah. Alright, so pick up the reins and then try to keep him low and down. I know, he has little flies, huh? Yeah. I don't see any, but they're all probably on him. Aww. Yeah, this is nice. Down in the pole, go ahead and pick up your trot again. Ah, oh, beautiful! He didn't even think about it, huh? Coming up. Awesome! Or I don't mind him going there, and if you don't want it, like say, okay, we're ready to do something, work, then it's just a little half a little leg to say, come up a little higher. But I love the fact that he does this on his own, huh? He wants to be there, that's such a good sign. He's so relaxed. So, okay, and there he had a fly. <laughs> All right, super. Okay, go um, to your collected trot, so go sitting trot a little bit. And, okay, well done. And down and the part. So definitely have some left flexion without. Down in the pole. Make sure you have hold enough in the front, huh? So you ride him nice and back and under you and with you, it's okay. I just can't see how, how uh, flexible he is when he does that. Back, sit back, sit back, well done, push through, well done. If you feel he's hesitating there, your leg comes in a little stronger, you say, okay, we're gonna do this. Nice. Very relaxed, don't trust him when he's too relaxed. Huh? Then you keep your leg ready. It's very easy for him to fall into something else. Nice. Play a little with the tempo here, just a little forward and back. You're sitting nice while well, you thought about it. Awesome. Very good. So think soft in your lower back. You try to be riding forward. It's almost that you get a little taller in your upper body when you ride it. There. Super. You stretch down a little bit in your front. You get a little taller on the front end. Your, your lower back stays nice and supple. Super. Make the circle a little smaller. And it's almost that you ride the shoulder in. You can flex him to the outside, almost like you're leg healing him in. It's kind of tricky, but it's a good way. Good. And the left hand tells him where to go. And the outside ring keeps him nice and soft. He's light, huh? Awesome. Leg healed him out without the thinking the shoulder needs to go. Exactly. So this side is a little easy. Go straight and think a little run there. So get his shoulder a little to the left, his nose a little right, and don't literally put his butt to the right. He might pop a change. Open the left hand a little bit. Good. Like that. Turn with left hand left. Left. Keep flexing him slightly to the right. Exaggerate his shoulder to the left. Like it's all that you want to leg heel him in. You're not going to do it, you go straight, but think leg healing the shoulder in. So his right shoulder is going to the left. Super! That's not hard, is it? Awesome! And you straight again, circle. And prepare for a nice trot with hands, no zero hands. Just from your seat. Get tall, close your thigh, get your weight in your stirrups. Just you beautiful, well done. Very, very pretty. All right, and when you're ready, go to your walk, and literally forward. Forward, 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 forward. <laughs> good. Uh, good job. I think that's enough warm-up for today. It's hot, so we have some horse left. What do you think? Yeah. He looks good, huh? Wow, yeah. Super nice. Good boy. Oh, what? I know I didn't do nothing. He's sweating.